We arrived in the Wild West, looking for my ancestor, Tennessee Kid Cooper, a legendary outlaw whose bank robberies were some of the most daring in Cooper lore. When we arrived, it took some time to locate him, but we eventually found him in prison. His arrest was the handiwork of the local sheriff, who had celebrated by posting his own picture all over town. Talk about an ego. We needed to bust Tennessee out of jail. But after some furious calculations, Bentley determined that the best way to do that was from the inside. For the first time in my career, I was gonna have to let the law catch me. This could be a real challenge. Bringing a noose for Tennessee, so we don't have time for a complicated plan. All my data points to one thing. The quickest route inside that prison is to get yourself arrested. Get myself arrested? I trust you, Bentley, but I'm not sure about getting locked up in this town. Sorry, Sly. It's the only way we're gonna reach Tennessee in time. There's just one problem. They're holding Kid Cooper in the maximum security wing. To get yourself thrown in there, you're going to have to gain outlaw status. So you need to make sure you build a rep before they catch you. Otherwise, they'll throw you in with the common criminals. Ugh, you mean like jaywalkers and litterbugs? Not gonna happen. Well, around these parts, it's probably more like goat thieves and tobacco spinners. But you get the point. For starters, why don't you try defacing all those posters of the sheriff around town? That ought to put a burr under his saddle. Get it? Because we're in the old west? Well, anyway, I'll just let you get started. Find a poster, make it look goofy, and move on. Just like junior high. Very nice, Sly. Not for sale. It's Uni Greenhorn. Wow. I bet the original artist damaged his vision staring at this guy. Oh, he's going to hate that one. Let's hope so. It's called No Good Lawman. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
If I was as homely as this guy, I would not hang my picture everywhere. You're on a tear, Sly! I wish I could tear them down. Here's Weakling of the West. I think Vane begins to describe this guy. Looking good, Sly. It's an improvement. I'll name this one the Homely Buckaroo. Sheriff puts up posters of himself. Wow, Sly! You made him look even worse! I love a challenge. I call it Ten Star Loser. This guy's a real egomaniac. I think he's just achieved troublemaker status. <laughs> oh, now this really chaps my hide! I'm going to find this artist and bust his thumbs! And maybe his pinky. <laughs> Absolutely. Apparently, the sheriff also loves lollipops, but his favorite is a particular Cuban variety, which has to be shipped in specially. Supposedly, they taste like rice and beans. Ugh, gross. Agreed. But if we clean him out, he'll have to wait weeks for the next shipment, and that should really tick him off. That lollipop. Great job! You just became a criminal fly. You know, you're a little too excited about sending me to the Slammer, Bentley. It's all about the job, Sly. Speaking of which, in case you hadn't noticed, this Sheriff Toothpick is his own biggest fan. In fact, it looks like he's throwing himself a festival, and it's in full swing. If you take that banner down, I'm sure it'll be the final straw. Right. Let's go rain on this guy's parade. Okay, I just need to get up to the I can't believe this guy has an appreciation festival for himself. 
Okay, there's the banner. I just need to knock those clothespins off. Hold your fires, boss! God damn, is this scribble. Lolly demon outlaw I've been looking for! Just book yourself a permanent room in this stony lonesome. <laughs> 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 